Hi guys, this is Joseph Flores, your music instructor, and today I'm going to teach you how to create a drum pattern for a house music track in Reason Compact. So first off, when you open up Reason Compact, you're going to see a window just like this with projects, and they're all going to be labeled. We're going to go ahead and we're going to click into the house music project. When you click into a project, you're going to see three different elements. You're going to see the drums, the lead, and the bass. Each one has its own particular window. Today, if, if you open it, it starts off with its own original pattern as so, and you can hear it like this by pressing play on the top. So what we want to do, we're going to lower the lead volume so that we can solely focus on the bass and the drums. From there, we're going to click into the drums by pressing on the blue area. From there, you're going to see your drum options, and you're going to be able to edit your drum pattern by clicking the grid square to the right of the play button on the top of your screen. So if you click this grid, you're going to see this is where your drums are. As you can see, all the blue squares are going to correlate with the sound that you're going to hear. If you press play, you'll hear the beat as so. Generally, first of all, we're going to delete everything so that I can show you exactly how to create your own house music pattern. So you're going to click the trash can on the top of your screen and you're going to delete everything on the track. Now you have a clear grid. If you press play, you'll be able to see the red bar going across your screen, letting you know where you are in your song. On the bottom of your screen, you can see how large of a selection you have. Here we have a one bar selection. You can make your selection up to eight bars, but we're gonna keep it on one bar for this example. It's also showing that we're using 16th notes as our squares. So for a house music track, you're gonna want your kick drum playing on every downbeat of the bar. That means four kick drums per bar. So you're going to click on the kick region as so to create four kick drums. And it's going to sound like this. Next, you're going to want to add a snare to your kick drum on the two and the four. So you're gonna put a snare next to the second drum and next to the fourth drum kick. That's gonna sound like so. Starting to sound like house music. Next, we're gonna focus on the hi-hats and, per and percussion elements. To add a hi-hat, you're going to go ahead and click on the hi-hat region every other square to create a nice pattern. Next, we can add some more percussion elements to add some flavor to the mix. And finally, some toms for some low end. And maybe some cymbals. Just to change it up a bit. 
Let's see how that sounds. Great, there you have it. That's how you're gonna create a house music drum pattern inside of Reason Compact. Now let's review. When you start, you're gonna see a screen as so. You're gonna to wanna to click into the house music project on the bottom. You're gonna to wanna to lower the lead volume of the red element so that you can focus on the bass and the drums. Then you're gonna to want to click into the blue region and click the grid box on top of your screen to the right of the play button. This is where you're gonna be able to create your own pattern. And on the top right, you can delete everything with the trash can and create your own. Great job guys. So today you've learned how to create a drum pattern for house music in Reason Compact. This is your music instructor Joseph Flores. Thank you for watching.